Hey, hey, fourth grade. Today, we are looking at human body systems, the digestive system, and we're working on visualiz visualization, which is standard 10 in our fourth grade science course of study. The objective for our lesson, you will be able to have an understanding of how food moves through the digestive system. All right, now this is the part where I want you to visualize. Make sure that you are comfortable in your chair Relax your shoulders, relax your arms, relax your legs, your face muscles, close your eyes, turn off all the noise, make sure that you're in a very quiet space. Visualize your hands holding a piece of your favorite food. Watch as your hands bring the food closer and closer to your mouth. The food is inside your mouth now. Picture the teeth crunch, slice and dice the food. The tongue mixes the food. The tongue mixes the food pieces with saliva. Then the tongue pushes the food to the back of the mouth. Whoosh. The food pieces move through a tiny flap and into a long tube to your stomach. There are muscles contracting and relaxing along the tube to push the food down. Splash. The food lands in the stomach like a kid landing a water slide. In the stomach, the same muscles swish the food pieces around and mix it with a burning acid. Ah, the tiny food pieces don't even look like food anymore. They are so small. After a few hours of this mixing around, the food pieces fall through another valve into the small intestine. Swish. Splat. The pieces are squirted with more chemicals and liquids so that they become even smaller. In the small intestine, the tiny food particles are absorbed into the walls. On the other side of the walls are blood vessels. The food catches a ride in the blood vessels and is dropped off at the leg muscles or quadriceps so that the legs can run and jump and play. It's a good thing that the food got picked up by the blood. Anything left over would have gone into the large intestine to turn it into poop feces. Open your eyes. So, while I was reading, you were visualizing the food going from the mouth, down the esophagus, into the stomach, into the small, uh, small intestine, large intestine, and then it gets ready for poop. So what I want you to do is, I want you to draw, and you can do this on paper, but I really would rather, and you can email it to me, but I really would rather that you try to draw it out here on Cami, um, because I, it gets confusing for me whenever I'm trying to find things in Schoology and look in for my, uh, and look in email. I'd rather you do it here, okay? So you're gonna draw what you saw in your mind when you visualize your favorite piece of food moving through the digestive system. And on here, I want you to tell me what is your favorite food that you pictured moving through the digestive system. Mine, my favorite food, pizza, apples, bananas, Pasta, cheese, I could go on and on. Those are some of my favorite foods. And then, once you have drawn what you visualize, I want you to come over to this page and I want you to write out um, what happens in the mouth, with the teeth and the tongue, what happens in the stomach when the muscles are contracting, what happens in the large intestines, what do the blood vessels do, large intestines, and anything extra that you need to write there. Hope you have a good day.